after a mysterious and controversial film dubbed The Bassano Tape finds its way onto YouTube, worldwide speculation and conspiracy erupts around Bax's revolutionary technology. Louis Moorfield, a documentary filmmaker, aims to get to the bottom of it. This is his film. Known as the Bassano Tape, the footage was reportedly stolen from Bax's research facility in Italy. Some say it proves the existence of Think, a new and highly advanced technology. Uh, it's obvious what's going on. Baxi are using aliens to advance their technical knowledge and improve their central heating systems. In return for what, though? That's the question. the face on YouTube. I saw some very strange lights hovering above the Baxi research facility, and it definitely wasn't aircraft. Whatever they're doing, it's wrong. Human faces belong on humans, not boilers. Some have seen the recent controversy as evidence of a new era, not only in boiler technology, but also in the way we live our lives. That the film somehow signals the dawn of a new age. Unsurprisingly, the press were quick to jump on the Bassano tape story. Under mounting pressure, Baxi finally came forward to issue a statement. Louis Moorfield was there. Baxi can confirm that we are working on a revolutionary new intelligent heating technology called THINK. We will introduce this cutting edge technology across our entire range of boilers, which will change people's lives for the better. But what about the face and the persona? Can you please just explain the face in the tape? Thank you. Come to today. No more questions. Are they playing with genetic engineering? Are they morphing and bioengineering? with human genes? Have they found support from extraterrestrial sciences? I aim to find out there's something more here and I'm going to get to the truth. Louis saw for himself what Baxi manufacturing was all about the innovation, the efficiency, and above all, the reliability. At the heart of the new range of condensing boilers from Baxi is a completely new and innovative THINK combustion management system, which has gas adaptive control to automatically monitor and adjust to varying external factors that might otherwise compromise the efficiency and performance of the boiler. Guys, look. There's Jason Pauzer. Let's go over there now and quickly grab him and I'll have a few words with him. Come on. So, there is something automatic about the way it thinks and controls the whole system, isn't there? That's right, yeah. So, that, and that's quite unique, isn't it? Yeah. So, tell me, what are the main benefits? Uh, of, of, of why would I choose one of these backseat boilers over any other boiler? I mean, what's the benefit to the, to the, to the consumer? The controls are very user-friendly and more importantly that we've got reliability. And economic. You could say that, yeah, that's very true. And it thinks for itself. And it thinks for itself. So what can you tell me about the, the, the green glows, the green, the green thing inside one of these boilers? I'm not noticing any green glow. You haven't? No, not at all. Don't know what you're talking about. Really? Louis was discovering about a new generation of domestic boilers. The new Nita Tech, small enough to fit into a standard kitchen cupboard the improved Duotech and the top of the range Platinum with its modulation ratio of 1 to 10. How the boilers use less gas and operate in condensing mode which can reduce emissions, fuel bills and wear and tear on components. All of which add up to significant cost savings over time. He kept hearing about increased reliability features like self-commissioning and common components that would make life much easier for installers. But still, the question remained. What was that face in the boiler? What did the tape mean? You describe this combustion control as intelligent. But where does this intelligence actually come from? The intelligence comes from the software in the PCB the way it talks to the gas valve via the ionisation signal on the flame. Right, so there's not actually a brain inside the boiler? Uh, living brain, no mate, I don't know what kind of boiler you're thinking of, this is just purely technology at its best. Is there something here that actually they're not telling me about the Bassano tape? Clearly, I need to find out more. 
Louis Moorfield was invited to the main office in Bassano, Italy, where the controversial tape was said to originate. After signing a worryingly lengthy confidentiality agreement, he was given exclusive access to their staff, including the managing director, Alberto Favaro. But the face in the boiler, do you know about that? He was ushered into the impressive research and development facility and introduced to Lamberto Del Grosso, the new product development director of Baxispar in Bassano. Louis was shown the state-of-the-art facilities, in particular the extraordinary testing laboratory, which was fundamental to Baxi's product innovation and reliability across all its markets. He still realized that some doors were being shut, and perhaps there was information he was not being given. Fascinating and very interesting! This is all, Louis. Thank you for your visit to Dubai. The tape must hold the secret. In a final throw of the dice, Louis Moorfield secured an interview with the divisional CEO of B.D. Arthur Mayer. It's his last chance to ask about the Bassano tape. Mr. Coffey, thank you very much for agreeing to see me. I've spent a lot of time trying to find out about the new Baxi boilers. Would you please explain the Bassano tape? The Bassano tip is simply um, a behind-the-scenes shot we made of our promotional video for this product range. And fortunately, it found its way onto YouTube, which obviously started off some of these problems. The system itself, obviously the face that we use, is purely a metaphor, effectively for the intelligence within the system. And that intelligence is the combined effort of all of the people who've been working on this project. An advertising campaign, then? Yes, an advertising campaign. So what exactly is Think Intelligence Within? What's different about this new technology? Well, I think Baxia has got a history and a pedigree of uh, pioneering developments in this area, obviously of heating and hot water. And this is our next stage of that development. And also what we're trying to do is future-proof it to work with other technologies such as solar, such as heat pumps. And effectively, the big challenge for all manufacturers today is to look at the overall cost and efficiency for the home unit. And also, the boiler itself is even able to self-diagnose any issues it has or any problems. So ultimately, what this is about is saving the consumer money, but also in terms of the environment with carbon emissions. If you'd like, I could show you the promotional video. Really? That'd be fantastic. Okay. that Louis was hoping for, but now the conspiracy theories could be laid to rest. He'd achieved what he'd set out to do, to reveal the truth, a truth which was still a story worth telling. Since this film was made, hundreds of people have trialed the new Think technology. One thing is clear, this amazing story shows no sign of ending anytime soon. Aliens or not. <laughs>